Hi, welcome to the best university, Texas A&M University, Kingsville. We bring this series about education in America to help prospective students keen on going to the USA. This is a product of hard work by our team of professionals and the faculty members who visited various universities in America. This will help to create an understanding among the students about the universities and university education of the USA. In this episode, we focus on Texas A&M University, Kingsville. Texas A&M University, Kingsville earned reputation as an institution that is synonymous for producing successful students. The Kingsville city is one of the safest city in the USA. The specialty of the university is to provide intellectually challenging education programs to students and thereby sets the highest academic standards. It has been striving to serve the population characterized by differences on the basis of nationality and culture. Our department has about 30 faculty members and uh, uh, recently we have started a new master's program. Uh, it is called Statistical Analytics, Computing and Modeling. Uh, this year we are expecting about 15 students and uh, uh, if things go okay, then next year we will have about 50 students. Uh, majority of the students are coming from Hyderabad and so we are very pleased. Uh, they will have a very good opportunity in fact in USA right now. Most of the 8,300 students of the university come from South Texas. The group comprises of students belonging to 35 states in the USA and 43 countries across the world. Almost 71% of the teaching staff held PhD degrees. The student to teacher ratio in the university is 16 is to 1. Every year they are targeting almost 70,000 jobs in statistics. So there is a golden opportunity for Indian students to join this program. Right now we have uh, about three TA ships that is teaching assistants and uh, up to five research assistantship. And then majority of the students, they will be doing grading. So they will get some money, uh, not too much of money, but some money they will get so that at least uh, uh, they can support here themselves. The university has a sprawling 250 acre campus. There are 80 buildings in the campus. Very close to the campus, a 545 acre form of the university is located. The university is affiliated to Southern Association of Colleges and Schools, Commission of Colleges to award bachelor's, master's and doctor degrees. It serves students irrespective of their social, economic, color, racial, gender, region, disability, nationality and veteran status. Kingsville basically came about in 1904. The uh, King Ranch uh, is do uh, gave some of the land to build the city and so some of the places that uh, people do go to see in Kingsville is the King Ranch. And we have a brochure here on the King Ranch. It is uh, over 825,000 acres. And uh, it's larger than the state of Rhode Island. So you can come in to visit, see uh, all kinds of things out there. Wildlife, you've got uh, the cattle, of course, and the cowboys on horseback working the ranch, actually working the ranch. And we've also got some great places that you can go and visit downtown Kingsville. So it depends on how many... Uh, assistantships a college or a program has. Uh, so eventually, in the, if, the, if you do not get financial aid in the first semester, it is possible that you would be getting the financial aid in the next semester or the following. So don't get disappointed that you did not get the fellowship in the first semester. Wait for some time, approach the faculty, ask them you know, if they can provide the research assistantship uh, and then you know, proceed like that. The university undergraduate programs are characterized by small size of the class national recognition to the courses, best of the professors, and a system that extends the best services to students. There are wonderful amenities available in the campus, not only to pursue education, but also to live. Residential halls and suits reflecting most modern lifestyle are located close to the campus. There are about 100 organizations active in the campus, catering to various tastes of students. The environment helps students become lifetime friends and inculcates leadership qualities among them. There are more research opportunities 
and uh, TA jobs and RA jobs are more available here. So I would recommend many students, Indian students to come here, grab as much as uh, opportunity they can because a lot of things are available here and uh, wish them a good luck for the future. There are five colleges that offer graduate programs in agriculture, natural resources and human sciences, business administration, education and human performance and engineering. They offer various courses in 43 subjects. Students who are not US citizens and those not enjoying the resident status are treated as international students. Each academic year comprises two semesters, each with a duration of about four and a half months. Admissions are open to the university in the fall season, spring season and summer season. We use a variety of materials to make the nanoparticles and uh, highly toxic drugs like camptothecin derivatives such as SN38, cisplatin. The computer science program is also part of the electrical engineering and computer science department. So it's a, it's a huge department. Um, I, I am the director for the graduate program in, in electrical engineering. And so there is also a computer science uh, program there. Um, the computer science uh, actually has more graduate students um, than, than the electrical engineering, but, but not, not by much. So they are, they are more or less, both the programs are pretty much balanced. The sports culture of the university is very rich. Students participate in games like baseball, basketball, cross-country golf, football, and track and field events. The Alumni Association of the university has members drawn from all the strata of society. In spite of this, the students share many things in common. Their personal relations and memories enrich their lives. The association initiates several measures beneficial to students and to their alma mater. This just happens to be our tennis team. And these are, uh, in, most of them on this tennis team are international. So, and most of them are undergraduate students. So we have a lot of athletes who on the undergraduate level are you know, bringing forth a, a wealth of, of education to our campus, to our community, to our area, and we're just very pleased about that. We have what's called homecoming. Homecoming is a traditional football game where there's a, all kinds of family activities and, and things like this. It's one home game that's played, and many, many more of the community come, and we have a king and queen well, we had two uh, Indian students who won, who took away the, they, or as we say, they ran away with all the, uh, the election, and so they were elected. Act as that is not part and parcel of admission procedures. The university takes into consideration the score achieved either in English or in mathematics for admission process. Students should route their Act or SAT testing scores direct to the university. Till the completion of the course, students should obtain a letter of sponsorship from the person who is sponsoring them. The sponsor should clearly mention that he or she will bear the full cost of education, living, health and other personal expenses of the student till the completion of the course. The sponsor could be their parents or any other person. The sponsor letter should be dated at least six months prior to the admissions. Similarly, the below mentioned bank statement should be carry a date that is at least 12 months ahead of the admissions. All students who got admission should attend the student orientation program before the end of the first semester. The program helps students know the resources in the campus group services. The program comprises two sessions, the pre-arrival orientation process and face-to-face -face orientation process. For any interested student, I would first suggest that they go to the university website, which is www.tamuk.edu. Again, it is www.tamuk.edu. That will give them a lot of information about, about the campus, about the different programs, not just educational programs, but also, also other programs that are related to the, the social life of the students or, or, um, or, or, or other professional uh, aspects of, of the student life here. Uh, it's a good university, uh, greenery everywhere. You have a lot of events uh, where students can participate and learn uh, new things. You have a lot of people to interact with each other. Uh, you have uh, too many people uh, with different culture, different religion, coming together, staying at one place, learning new things. <laughs>